What is up, y'all? It's your boy, man. We out here, dog. We are doing a bus build. And let me show y'all the bus. Man. Look at it right there. Big Sally. That's what we could name in this bus right here. Big Sally. Got the homie Rhino right there. And a bull hauler. So let me take you around this thing. This is a bluebird right here. It's a 1991 uh, bluebird. And uh, I want to say it's an 84 passenger bus, which is one of the longest. If not, it's a 74 or something like that. It's a long bus. It's going to be extremely loud, y'all. We got the Predator running right now. It wasn't starting up for us, but we finally got it running. So we got some under storage right here on the right hand side and we have the Allison transmission. Look at baby girl. Say what's up to the folk. Stop it. <laughs> and we got the 5.9 Cummins in here, man. It says it's got 14,000 miles on this bus, but it is a 91, so I don't know. It could be it could be true, I don't know. I think this bus was once used as a on the military base, and so I think that's what it's from. You know, they don't really use them like that. A lot of times they just sit around and so but we got this bus man and we're gonna turn it into our little tiny home a little bit and y'all stay tuned so we got games we got we're gonna have cooking like y'all know that as well as trucking trucking on ATS which I got to do the second part to the Christmas hauls and uh, we're gonna get that done but right now we're working on the bus today knocking out the seats and we're going to take out the sub floor and we're going to uh haul that stuff to the dump most likely tomorrow because it's late but as y'all can see you got two under storage carriages on the left side and then that's your battery box right up in there other than that y'all we just need to do a, a service on the engine change the oil uh change the transmission filter uh because that's leaking and we topped it off with some uh, radiator coolant, some engine coolant, and we need to get the horn working because the horn doesn't work. Other than that, we got um, three clearance lights like that up top that we gotta change the light bulb on. And other than that, y'all, we can get it inspected, but one of the first things you gotta do to make a school bus legal is you gotta get the school bus off there and the, the school bus off the side as well as like the riding on the side and on the back and other than that take some pictures and you're good to go but uh we're gonna keep on at it y'all i'm excited because it's been a long time coming we've been had like you know some ideas of doing a bus conversion and you know we just didn't do one and you know when we find a platform it wasn't quite right and all that type of stuff so uh cool thing about this one we got this one at a dealer shop so you don't have to be concerned with the title and all that stuff it is a blue title so it's clean title and the only other people that owned this bus was the people who made it as well as um the isd that was using it so other than that that's it y'all let's get back to work
The wife is here. Say what's up to the fam. Hey. Yeah, as you can see, we got some stuff knocked out. Step back over here. We got some stacked up. Oh, nice. So half of the front. Oh, yeah. I just going to do the back. And some of those back there are also unbolted as well. We just got to stack them too. And it's coming along. This bus did come with inside AC units. We will not be using those. It do have some nice luggage racks in here. We'll probably keep some and we'll keep some of them or some portions of it. For the you know, hang dishes in there, or stack dishes, you know, whatever else. Maybe turn in uh, some of these skylights right here. Or should I say emergency exits into skylights. Bring in some more light. And uh, yeah. Did you get Stucky? So. Where's Stucky? Uh, I think uh, Stucky is her uh, pet moth. moth. Our black moth. <laughs> but that, mug, that mug is gone. Alright, so we're going to get back to it, y'all. So y'all can see we're getting down to the, the actual paper. floor of it. Rip up this subfloor stuff and Just we'll be cover. all good. See, see it right there. Mm -hmm. There you go. I ripped up some. Look, baby. <clears throat> It's just wood underneath here. Underneath yep. the rubber. Yep. And we're going to take all that out. Get that rotten wood out of here, which is the subfloor, and we'll be down to the bare metal, and we'll be on it. Yep. Yeah. Check it out, y'all. Which, I mean, you got to use what you got to use, right? Okay. And that's what we're just doing right now. All right. Last part coming off. Woo! Good job. 
All right, y'all. So they went ahead. You know, they're done with that part, and having a dilemma about this door because it's not a split door. It's one of those that's yeah, it's not split in the middle. Yeah. So it's kind of like lock here or something. Or we got to figure it out. So we're gonna do some research on it. I got that so this is rubber. Now don't get the rubber. And right yeah. here, there's rivets. And, and don't get it twisted. This door does lock, but it just locks in the front, or like on the inside. And it locks hard. And it locks lock hard, it so we got to figure out something. We could do it. Oh, there's, there's a metal rubber. right here, though. Let me see. Yeah, that is, that is metal. All right, so the plan is to put a big lock back here. Um, like right here. Like right there, so we can lock this door. We'll probably put like some some steps, like retractable steps, in the future. Like come from up under the the um, bumper. But for right now, we we'll just get a step stool. Boom, boom, boom. Right. To so lock it up for right now, because we're trying to secure everything, so we don't have to whack it around like our generator and all the other supplies that we got for the bus. So. Other than that, we got the back off the school bus. Back is uh, off. The number is off. Um, as well as the ISD is yeah, off, the, off side. the side. And so we're ready to register it. Also, the school bus that was down there up below uh, is off. It's a little loud, sorry. Yeah, ISD is off. It doesn't say school bus there, so we're good. All right, y'all, it is the end of day three. No, I got two fingers up. It's all good. It's three, but bro. <laughs> we, we arguing about when we started this. Anyway, end of day three, three of the bus build of Big Sandy. As y'all can see, we got a lot of stuff cleared out. And um, now it's time to... You know, basically wrap this up. We've been trying to get a latch to go over the uh, front door up there. And it's been trying. Uh, the doors on this bus just, it's not split in the middle. So that's what makes it hard. Makes it a little hard. But uh, other than that, uh, we'll be working on the floor pretty soon. And finishing, well, we that, finishing that up. We're going to get the rest of those out. And we just gotta go buy another grinder because the two we had they uh fizzed out. They burnt out, they, they burnt fizzed out. out. Which but, I mean look at all the work though that they were able to do, you know, so it is what it is. It is what it is. And we gotta go get a new drill. Yeah, we're gonna get a new drill, as they were saying. Yeah, yeah. And we're gonna finish this up like you know, we're gonna fill in these little holes. You know, okay. some of them are a little bigger than others, but it's okay. We're going to gonna fill in the holes. And we're going to get a little bit of JB Well stick yeah. or steel stick. And then also some other kind of uh, sealant. And we're going to knock the rest of these heads, heads off of these bolts or screws in the floor. This is the biggest hole we've got right And here. we're going to do our best to figure out this heating system running back here but it, it's gonna have to be capped off somewhere so probably up here up there or so we can take all of that stuff or out. or whatnot take all that out and, that, yeah. and the ac out yeah and we're gonna eventually get rid of these old ac units too well, we but we're heat. not in a rush for those because they're not being used they they're disconnected anyway so yeah. other than that we're gonna take some of these shelves out probably not up here probably but back there. But we're gonna keep these ones and we're gonna put wood around them to make yeah. it like really nice. So if you have the mm -hmm. cabinets. And yeah. yeah, so that's that's the goal, y'all. And we I was wanting like a skylight in here yeah, for one, at least for one of them, or if not both, it's no matter. Okay. And we'll have it really nice in here. We wanted to do a quick uh Recap. cap real quick. So we went over to we got the rest of the floor out on this this, this passenger side, and we went to the dump, the city dump, dumped all those chairs and wood and all that good stuff. We got all the stickers off the the bus, 
that need to be off to be so it's legal. Drivable. Drivable. <laughs> yeah, so it's drivable. And so that's it, y'all. Anyway, we're going to say so long for now. But this is phase on. one, uh, part of many parts. This is the part of, you know, day one, two, and three, more or less. On day one, we didn't really do anything. So. <laughs> well, we got one sheet out. That was it. Exactly. But so that's why I don't count it as a day. But anyway. It was work. You know what I'm saying? One seat is work. Oh my God. But anyway. Yes, bro. We got all that <laughs> done on one, two, and three days. And we're going to say so long for right now. Stay tuned to see what's the up next on the Sandy bus bill. Big Sandy. Big, Big Sandy. Sandy. You know, coming at Big Sandy. <laughs> Big Sandy. So, all right, y'all. Deuces.